Hello Music Con Brio students and families. This video is for the violin students in the six o'clock class and we are going to work on some note reading today. So we've been working a lot on note reading lately. Um, so we're going to do something a little bit different today. We're going to use the note reading flashcards, but we're also going to use our violin. So grab your violin. You don't need your bow. We're just going to be sitting in rest position and plucking. So I will show you a note. Um, I'll show you a note card. And your job is to tell me what the note is and how you play it. So for example, we'll just take the first one. You'll look at the note, tell me what it is and how to play it. So the note is D and this is open D. And then you're actually gonna play it. So you'd say D, it's open D and there it is. Okay, so even though I can't see or hear you, um, I, would I would like for you to say those things and play the note out loud. It's really good practice for you. The point of this video is to get used to seeing notes on the staff, on the page, and then transferring that knowledge to the instrument to know how to play what you read. Okay, so let's get started. You've already seen the first one, so it's a freebie. The note is D, it's open D, and you play it like this. Good, okay. We're gonna go in order here for a little bit to make it easy on us. So this note is E, and it's one on D. Let's play it. Good, okay. Now this next one, tell me what the note is first. Yep, it's F, and on this one I wrote in a sharp. Um, because all the notes we're playing today are going to be on the tapes. And as we'll learn later, some of the notes that are written on the staff um, make us play something that's not on the tape. So for today, we're not even going to mess with that. We're going to keep it simple. So if you see a sharp, just know that it's that note plus a sharp. Okay? So this note is F plus the sharp means this is F sharp. And it is two on the D string. So find your second tape. F sharp is two on D. Did your pitch match my pitch? F sharp. Good. Okay, next. Okay, the note is G and it is three on the D string. Let's play it. All right, three on D is G. Good, nice. Okay, moving on to a new string here. The note is A, and it is open A. Let's play it. Nice, beautiful open A. Okay, next, I bet you can guess what's coming next. Okay, the note is B, and it's one on the A string. Let's play it. Good. Okay, here's another one with a sharp. So the note is C sharp, and it's two on the A string. Can you find two on A? Should sound like this. Good. All right. And I know we're going a little fast, but don't worry, we're gonna go over these several times, okay? And you can always pause the video and go at your own pace if you need to. Okay, this one is D and it's three on the A string. So A string, one, two, three. There's your D. Good. All right, keep going up, new string. This is E and it's open E. Let's play it together. Beautiful, nice job. And continuing the pattern. Yeah, this is F sharp. So that's one on E. Find that first tape. F sharp is one on the E. Good. Okay, next note. Remember, if we just had F, which is the top line, then the very next note is gonna be G. Think about the alphabet. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. And it's got 
about a sharp. So this one is G sharp, and it's two on the A. Second tape. Two on the A. Good. All right. Yep, after G in the, al in the musical alphabet, after G is A, and A is three on the E string. Let's play it. Three on E. Very good. Okay, we've got one more high note here. This is a ledger line note, just like A. So A was on that line, remember? The next one is B. And B is actually fourth finger on the E string. So many of you have a fourth finger tape, which is great. If you do, go ahead and extend your pinky so it's resting on that fourth tape. Use a nice tall tunnel. And if you don't have a fourth finger tape, use your ear to match my pitch. Here it is. B, four on the E string. All right, great job, my friends. Now, you might have noticed we skipped over the G string. So here are those notes. Sadly, we don't have a flash card for open G, but this one picks up where that left off. So let's count down to figure out what note it is. So the bottom line is E, the next one down is D, the first ledger line would be C, then B in between, and finally down here is A, and this is one on the G string. Take a good look. So that one is A, one on G. Let's play it. Good, very good, okay? Take a look at this one. Use your strategy of counting down. So this one is B, and it's two on the G. Let's play it. There you go. B, two on G. We've got one more here. I bet you can guess what it is. So the note is C, and it's three on the G string. Let's play it. Good friends, really, really nice job. Okay, so we just went through all of the flashcards that we have on all four strings. Um, I'd like to mix them up now and try them again. So if you need to just go back through them in order again, please, please do that. Stop the video right now, go back to the beginning and do that again as many times as you need to to start feeling comfortable with that, okay? But for now, I'm gonna mix them up a little bit And let's see if we can start to pick out some notes. All right. Okay, ready to try again? Here we go. Every good boy does fine. This is an F, and in this case it's F sharp, and it's one on the E. Let's play it. Very good. One on the E. F sharp. Ooh, some of these aren't mixed up very well. So tell me what the note is and how to play it. This is G sharp, and it's two on the E string. E, F, G. Think about the alphabet. So two on E, G sharp. Okay, this one's right next to the previous one. This one is A, and it is three fingers on the E string. Okay, let's play it. Three on E, good. Okay, next one. This is D, and it is open D. Let's play it. Very good. Yep, this is E, and it's one on the D. Let's play that. Good, if your pitches are matching mine, you're doing great. Next one. Okay, this is F sharp, and it's two on the D string. Let's play it, two on D. Very nice. Every
every good. So this is a G, and it is three on the D string. Let's find it. Good. Next. Okay, this one is A, and it's open A. Let's play it. Good. Ooh, okay, this one's a little out of order. Let's see if you're on your toes, ready to figure it out. Every good boy does. This is D, and we know it's not open D, right? So even by looking at it, you can tell it's much too high for that. So this one is three on the A string. A, B, C, D. Think about the alphabet. Three on the A string. Good. There it is. Okay, how about this one? Every good boy. This one is B, and it is one on the A string. Let's play it. Good. Okay. Face in the space, F, A, C. So this one is C sharp, two on the A string. So A, B is one, and C sharp is two. Good, good, very good, friends. All right, F, A, C, E, this one's an E. And what do you think? How do we play it? If you're thinking open E, you are right. Let's play it. Very good. Okay, this one's pretty high up there, but you can do it. You know how to figure it out. Okay, so this one is B. We know that because we count up from F, F, G, A is on the line, and B is above it. And we can use the alphabet to help us figure it out. We know it's on the E string, right? So E, F sharp, G sharp, B, A, B! B is fourth finger on the E string. Make sure your pitch matches mine. B! Good. A few more here. Okay, this one is a C, and we know it's pretty low. It's below the staff, so it's on the G string. And this is going to be three on G. Let's find it. Three on G. C. Just a couple more. You're doing great, friends. Count down. Use your knowledge. This one is A, and it's one on the G. There is our A. Very good. Last one here. Okay, this one is B, and it's two on the G. All right, let's find it. Good, there it is. All right, my friends, very, very well done. I am gonna go through the deck one more time quickly, so I'm not gonna give much explanation at all. This one, this time through the deck is your chance to really quiz yourself. So uh, see, make sure you take the time though to really learn the ones that you need to practice. And then once you've perfected that, Go through this time in the video and see if you can get them pretty quickly and play them like right away, okay? All right, let's do it. Last time. E, one on D. G sharp, two on the E. Oops, there it is, second tape. D, open D. C, three on the G. B, one on the A. Doing great, keeping up with my quick pace. C sharp, two on the A. E, open E. G, three on D. A, open.
open A. Doing great. D, three on the A. B, four on the E. <laughs> Good job, friends. A, one on the G. <laughs> Few more. B, two on the G. F sharp, one on the E. A, three on the E. Last one. F sharp, two on D. Great, great job, my friends. Feel free to keep practicing through this as many times as you need to. Really nice work. I will see you next time.